up with chickens and then they've always been a part of my life. They are kind of characters, they have their own personality, they're fun to work with and I, I just I very much enjoy working with them. Growing up, I, I was involved with 4-H and I was also involved in exhibition poultry. And so when I decided about going to, to college, I, I really wanted to focus in agriculture. And that's how I kind of got down to the University of Arkansas for graduate school and then fell in love with poultry genetics. So this project started way back in 2018 when we were thinking about how we can make a more sustainable broiler. We did partner with Alternative Design. They really helped us develop that technology to be able to select for water efficiency. Companies weren't looking into water efficiency as really we lack the technology to accurately and efficiently um, measure water intake on an individual bird basis. So to be able to do that at an industry level just really wasn't possible. We will get a hatch of pedigreed birds, meaning we know who mom and who dad is for each individual bird. When we write their pedigree information on their egg, we'll place them in an individual red vegetable bag. So when those chicks hatch, they are contained to that bag, so we'll, we will be able to give them an individual wing band um, that has a number that's specific to them. And that number will let us know who mom is, who dad is. So going forward in the future, we're able to control kind of the inbreeding of the population. So we're collecting data based on how they grow and how they consume water. From that data, we're able to select for the next generation of breeders based on their information. I've seen the, the project morph and the idea grow into now where we've got a, a whole novel system to measure water. Seeing project grow as far as moving towards divergent selection and working more with the birds as opposed to the system after that system got developed. We know that there's water scarce regions all over the world and even in the U.S. I and mean, when we're producing 9 billion broilers a year, we really can, can impact the industry if we select for a water efficient bird. And we'd like to see the industry kind of take on that um, challenge and meet that challenge for the industry and for the consumer. With us being at the university, we're able to focus on that trait um, pretty specifically and kind of see if there are any negative impacts from selection for water efficiency. It's really been a new development, I think, looking at um, water and looking at sustainability in general. And I think it's been a great time seeing people get excited over sustainability and, get it, and seeing people get excited over saving resources and managing resources and, and having the opportunity to work with a chicken that can possibly meet those needs.